I know it is so exciting in here. There's so many things to look at. I decided that poetry can be celebrated all year long. So you're going to see stuff in the decorations that's from the whole year. There's a beach towel for the summer. There's a pumpkin for the fall. There's flowers for the spring. There's snowflakes for winter. All right, there's just a little bit of everything. Because poetry can be celebrated all year. All the seasons. Yeah. So, friends, we are going to record this. We're recording it right now. So that later and you can share it with me okay so i will share the link to this later but i want to start us off with a poem that was in my pocket and it's a poem that i love that's about a poem in your pocket now remember after someone reads we celebrate that person with snaps or you can do a quiet clap okay a quiet clap or if you practice something else that's okay too. <laughs> Great. So notice how I'm right in front of the microphone. Do you see that? And I'm speaking up because I'm wearing a mask. So you kind of have to speak up even a little bit louder than usual. And here is my poem. Keep a poem in your pocket and a picture in your head. And you'll never feel lonely at night when you're in bed. The little poem will sing to you, the little picture bring to you, a dozen dreams to dance to you at night when you're in bed. So keep a picture in your pocket and a poem in your head, and you'll never feel lonely at night when you're in bed. Friends, I am going to turn it over to you to start sharing your poetry. And Notice, you see how there's a cord up here? So be careful that your feet aren't getting tangled in the cord so you, that you trip when you stand up. Okay, so just be careful. And I think I'm oh, going to get no. in that, okay? And then I'm going to sit up and remember, like we practice in class, I'll call you. Watch how I'm going to walk around the cord. I'm going to come sit down. Ew. Ew. I'm going to wait for the video. Now, I told you my poem comes from a trip I took, and I went to a place called Moose, Montana, and I saw a real moose. This isn't the moose I saw, but it, when I saw this picture, I wanted to write about this moose. Moose, oh moose, what will you do? Drink the deep cold water, nibble the sweet green grass. Moose, oh moose, tell me your thoughts. I'm wondering just like you. I'm going to move over here. If you feel rainy, put a thumb up over your heart. I'll see you, I'll call you, and I'm going to stay up here next to you. Wilder. He rests you have very sharp teeth, a long tail, stop a beat. Show your picture. I'll go to give a thumbs up if you're ready. I'm looking at you. And now you come on up. Are you ready? Guess what? I love deer. I love my parents. <laughs> Good job, Anaya. Chase, come on up. You look really ready. We're doing 
doing a really good job with your poems. Thank you. Come around on this side. Mm -hmm. Okay, you ready, Jane? Get in there. All right, Giraffe is in his room. He is playing, jumping, and running around. <laughs> Well, some of the poems are silly, some of them are funny, some of them are happy, but I love every single one. All right, I see Caldwell's got her thumb up over her heart. All right, come on up, Caldwell. Remember, come on this side. Everybody get your ears ready. Charlie, 